Don't forget, diamonds, chocolate, and flowers make your sweetie laugh tonight. Mm, that's right. And don't worry, you don't have to tell the jokes because our next guest is going to be doing that. <laughs> Comedian Jeremiah Watkins joins us this morning for some very funny Valentines. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Thank you for joining us. Thank you for having me have on this. Have you ever been to Syracuse? No, it's, you know, I try to come here every Valentine's Day, but <laughs> this is the first one I can make happen. So, uh -huh. so yeah. wait, why do you try to come every Valentine's Day? Oh, it's the Day? most romantic city there is, ladies. <laughs> <laughs> yep, Syracuse is what I think of whenever I think of falling in love and romance, so I'm here. Well, you must already be in love because you have a ring on your finger. I, I was do? a little worried oh, about well, you. You know, she put a, yeah, she, she was a, a, she was a single a lady, she put a ring <laughs> on it. Yeah, I'm uh -huh. taken. Watch mm -hmm. out. So if you're coming to the shows tonight, single, I can't make it happen. Mm -hmm. But I can, I'm a great wingman, though. I guarantee you will make love with somebody either in the audience or at home by the time that the show ends. In the audience? In the audience. Oh, it could right. be a waitress, a waiter. It could be the ticket terror. It doesn't matter. Uh -huh. We'll hook it up. Because you have some love jokes. Got some love. Yeah, you could, that's a nice way of putting it, <laughs> love jokes. Yes. No. Leave it right there. Yeah. <laughs> no, no, seriously, you were here last night. You performed last yeah. night. Uh, yeah, an orgy broke out. It was oh, wild. Oh, goodness. Yeah. Oh, right. yeah, yeah. Well, let's talk a little bit about <laughs> very sexual shows. I, apparently, and it's perfect for Valentine's Day. I mean, you came on the right night. You did. Right yes, weekend. you. If you come on the right night, then that would oh be my God. to. <laughs> No, wait, uh, no, what? If you come on the right night to see me, then you will have a great date night. Yes. Where are okay, you from originally? Right. I'm originally from Kansas. Kansas? Yeah. Kansas. Well, you ain't in Kansas that, that's anymore. Getting, that's getting laughs off screen. Uh, that's not even a joke. Wait, I'm from you know, Kansas, and that's wait, getting laughs in the studio. Do you know Jeff G? Yeah, of course I know <laughs> Jeff G. Yeah. What do you think about Jeff G? That's oh, what you want to know. No, I don't know who Jeff G is. People ask me these questions all the time. Do you know this person? If Kansas isn't that small well, where saying, I know the people. Basically what we're saying, did you yeah. listen to our host chat we were talking about the guy that's paying twenty five thousand dollars oh to, that guy yeah, he's from that's Kansas. oh that's my uncle yeah <laughs> Yeah, yeah, yeah. That guy who is uh, paying twenty-five thousand dollars for uh, what do you, what do you that think guy. Of that? What do I think of him? Yeah. It's a bad look for Kansas. What are you doing, Jeff? <laughs> there you go. Oh my goodness! Yeah. Change your jeans, buddy. What's going on? <laughs> That's why I mean, I'm he's. It's, this is a serial killer if I've ever seen <laughs> one. But right. There's a golden retriever running around. Are you kidding me? Yeah. Everything looks staged here. Like I am a human. I am not a robot. I promise I will not throw you in my trunk by the end of tonight. This guy is going to murder you, and it's only going to cost you twenty-five thousand dollars. <laughs> I love it. You know what? This is why you need to go see him tonight. Right? Hilarious. Now, listen, people may have already seen you. You've been, you've done sketches on Jimmy Kimmel Live. Yeah, you've been yeah. on David Spade's show by yes, right Yes, just on, yeah. Who are some of your uh, comedic influences? Oh, man. Uh, I love, um, I love Mr. Bobby Lee, if you've ever had him. Mm. Uh, I, uh, I, I featured for him for years. Um, also, uh, uh, I work a lot with uh, my pal Tony Hinchcliffe on okay. the road, mm -hmm. and uh, there's great guys like Rory Scovel and Eric Andre out yeah. there, and uh, yeah, I love all those guys. Cool. Yeah. What do you, you know, you're on the road, it's Valentine's Day, what do you like most about traveling and doing these shows around the country? Did you bring your wife? No, yeah. but there is lotion at the hotel. Oh um, my gosh, I, can't, uh, I just that's, can't. <laughs> Uh, no, I, it, the, it doesn't make sense for my wife to come on certain ones. Like, if I did uh, comedy in Hawaii, I might try to make that happen. Yeah. But I'm not going to force her to come to Syracuse. It's zero degrees outside right now. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. There was a lady outside who walked by and she goes, oh, it's brisk out. It's not brisk out here. It's freezing. It's horribly cold right now. My L.A. brittle bones are almost breaking right now. Oh, now all of a sudden he lives in L.A. and he's got I've been brittle there bones. For, I've been oh. there for 10 years. My blood's thinned out since I lived in Kansas. I'm a wimp now. Oh, uh, uh, yes. You, you, well, yeah, listen. There we go. <laughs> <laughs> you want to make fun of him, you can tonight because he's going to be at the Syracuse Funny Bone Wait, uh, tonight at... <laughs> you want to make fun of me? At 7.30. You're going to make fun of other people, listen, probably. Listen, this is a warm day. Okay? Yeah. Uh, you can catch him tomorrow night at 7 at 9.45. It's Syracuse Funny Bone inside of Destiny USA. And um, listen, you can also find him online, JeremiahWatkins.com. Thank you. Such a pleasure talking to you. Such a pleasure talking to you, <laughs> ladies. You. Happy we'll Valentine's right Day. Happy, Val Happy Valentine's yeah. Day. We'll be right back.